Children of the Jack Andrew Tree, as um, Arzu said, it's um, based partially on my family's experience in Iran after the revolution. So um, the Iranian Revolution of 1979. So it's about um, what happened to those who had actually participated in the revolution, had believed in the revolution, but um, continued to fight after the revolution because the Islamic regime wasn't exactly what they had um, fought for. And um, in 1983, all of these um, political activists um, were arrested, activists from every different political background you could possibly think of. They were all arrested after four years of um, relative um, tolerance um, from the regime. They were all arrested. And um, in 1988, thousands of them, um, the number goes anything from 4,000 to 12,000 people um, were um, executed and um, sort of dumped into mass graves. That's why we don't know the exact number. My parents were arrested in 1983. My mom was pregnant with me, and um, so I was born in prison. And that sort of um, is what the first chapter is about. And um, in 1988, fortunately, my parents were released. But in 1988, my uncle was um, executed. And um, so that's sort of the theme of the novel. Seven narratives sort of revolve around the theme. So I didn't want to talk about only the prisoners. There's, there are only two chapters based in um, sort of um, I inside prison. But I wanted to talk about the families and, uh, and the friends, and especially and above all about the children who were born in those years, and then what happens to them, and then how they want to make their own history in 2009 with the new protests. Um, the, I've been asked many times why I didn't just write a biography and um, why write a novel? And um, I've, that's why I started thinking about why I didn't do it, other than the fact that I want it to be a creative process and, and so on. And is that now that I think about it, what is important to me and was at the time wasn't so much telling yet another prison story about Iran. It wasn't that. Although this is different, it is about the activists of who were in, in, in the revolution. But it's it's not about my birth in prison, it's not about my uncle's execution, it's not about my family, but I think it's a period that did change um, the history of Iran forever. So it's not about what happened to my family, but I think this book is about, in a way, the genesis of a dictatorship. How is a dictatorship born? What happens? How does it develop? What does it do to a people? How it affects us? politically, of course, but also personally, emotionally, physically, and, um, and how it takes toll on, on the lives of everyone and how it is resisted by everyone as well.